Oh, hello guys, welcome back to another Oceans game. And as you can see, this is my epic fishing farm for my Skyblock series. And I'm just hanging out over here trying to get some good item. And last time, I forgot that I do actually have a Unbreaking 3 thing. Uh, I do have Unbreaking 3 enchanting, enchanted book, it's this one. What's infinity, which is I don't really need infinity, so I guess I'm just gonna um uh put this on my elytra right now. If my elytra, yes, it's over here. Okay. All right. Okay, that not too expensive. Mending, I'm breaking through on my elytra. That's very good. And let's go sleep. Also, I put a carpet in my house just so it looks a little bit nicer. I didn't do anything on the second floor because I haven't decided. Do I really? Should I really put carpet over there? Not too sure. And also, something I did in the meantime, just kind of to save the time so I don't have to do that boring thing on the camera, is I built a huge platform. <laughs> Look how big it is. It's very big. And the reason why I'm building this because I, I am a little bit short on paper to make enough fireworks. What? What is a weird sound? Okay, anyways, I am very short on paper because this sugarcane farm over there, it's not good enough. I do need like, I need a lot more. And we got some wandering trader over here. Was he Slamas? I mean, this, these two are stole from the, 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 like the other guy, but what does he have? Sapling, pumpkin, fish. Spur spot a sapling. So okay, maybe we could get a bucket of fish so we could have we could actually have some like actual fish. Yeah, maybe I should. Um how many ambro do I have? Do I have enough to trade? Yes I do. Okay. Hi sir. Hi uh sir. Sir? Oh there you are, sir. I would like to have two bucket of fish. Thank you, sir. Thank you. And let's put the little fish over here and over here. Ooh, look at them having a good time. All right. And I need some water, obviously, just cause. Okay. Oh, okay, a little laggy. Okay, that's fine. We're good. Let's put the water bucket back. Okay, now here comes the question. Should I kill this dude right here to get his llama? I already have two. Do I need more? I mean, I kind of need this llama right here, like this brown dude over here, because I don't have the color. And it's fine. Okay, so, get to the point of today's goal is, I want to make a automatic sugarcane farm, so I could get a lot of paper. And to do that, it's actually pretty easy, but I do need a lot of piston and observer and some redstone, so... Maybe I shouldn't trade all of the Ambro with this wandering trader over here because I need a lot, lot of redstone, which is I only have four. I mean one, so I need a lot more. I have enough iron. Okay, that's good news. Um, let me get more cobblestone just cause, just cause I do need cobblestone to build it to build a base, and I need some dirt. Uh, how many dirt? Okay, I need a lot more dirt. Okay, that's 61 dirt. Whew, that's a lot of dirt. Okay, uh, let's see, let's see. Where should I make my... Okay, uh, I need a water bucket also. Actually, I need two. So let's just grab two. Okay, um, let's do this. So I don't want to destroy the torch just because I do need to keep this place lit. For safety purposes, so yeah, that could be a problem. But you know, I don't think it would be that big of a problem. And yeah, let's take a look. My water bucket over there. I'm looking for. So the plan is, I will put sugar around the dirt. Uh, is this good? Yeah, it's good. Hmm, maybe a little bit too far off. Maybe I should go in the center like two more blocks just so it's a little bit safer. Yeah, let's just go in like two blocks. 
Okay, okay, up, 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 what happened there? Oh, 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 okay. Oh, my torch got washed away. Let's put it down again, just so it's safe in the night time. You know, no mob is going to spawn. Oh, wait a minute. I don't think my... Uh... Did I miss something? You know, let's just put one there. Why not? Okay, so the water should push it down here. All right. And then we have to make another one over here. Uh, where's my dirt? I do have to keep a distance. Uh, yeah. Well, I guess I'm gonna put this torch over here. Uh, uh, okay, there's some weird things going on with my mouse. I really don't know why, but... Okay, this should be long enough. Yes, perfect. All right, let's put those uh, bucket back. But I'm just gonna fill it up with water. And there's my fish. Oh wow, my fish was drowning. Don't drown, little fish. Oh uh, well, I don't have enough sugar cane to fill up the gaps, but that's fine. And wait a minute, where's my silk touch tool? Uh, silk touch. Yes, there's a silk touch. Why well, I'm getting a silk touch? Well, you will know. Like that, like that. A grass block. And I need a grass block because I, I would like this to be full of grass. And now the grass just spread. Good, I got a silk touch tool. Especially the shovel because I do need to move the grass a lot. What else do I have? Do I have silk? Oh, I have silk touch on a pickaxe. And silk touch on another pickaxe, and silk touch on an axe, not a pickaxe. And that's pretty much it. Okay. Alright, well, before we really do anything, I just want to put down those sugar cane over here, just because I need a lot more. Like, a lot more. Can I get those ones? Yes, I could. What happened to this llama over here? What is he trying to do? Like, what are you doing, dude? Okay. That's really weird. Um. Okay. Do you want to be free? I mean, I could kill your owner and make you free. Alright, let's do it. No, let's not do it. Just kidding. I don't want to kill the watering trader. He's very nice. Let's put the sugar cane down. Just so I could at least, uh, you know, grow a little bit more before I actually make this. Auto sugar cane farm and okay, that's pretty much it for now. Um, we do need a lot of um things to trade. And why there's an iron golem? Okay, I have to kill this dude right here really quick, just because he's not supposed to be here. That should do it. All right, more iron. That's fine because I do need iron. I mean, I should kill a few more iron golems just so I can trade with my villagers. Uh. Oh, there's an enderman. Well, I don't have to do anything with the enderman because iron golem should take care of the enderman pretty easily. Okay, let's see. Is anyone going to give me a good trade? I don't think so, but... Oh, what happened there? Whoa, wait, okay, what happened to the farm? Guys, let me put the carrot down for you. So, is anyone going to give me some good trade? Okay, you take carrot, that's not bad. Uh, what about you? Um, nope. You, uh, uh, okay. Uh, nothing I could trade for Embro. I need a lot more. Okay, oh, you take four iron for one Embro? Okay, that's a, that's a little expensive. Do I have a cheaper guy? You take nothing. Nope. Okay. Uh, we're just gonna keep trying. I haven't tried this dude. Come on. Nope. You have nothing. Ah, uh, you're still taking four. Okay. There has to be some guy that only take like two iron, right? Nope. That's not the right one. Where is the one looking? Oh, and this guy doesn't even trade. Uh, wait. Oh wow, you take 20 string for one embro? Wow, fisherman, I'm shocked. 
Okay, you know what? I just need to go back and sleep. I need to go back and sleep. This is not going to work. All the villagers just running around, freaking out. I can't even have a trade with them. Huh. I need to eat fish. I I need a little bit more food. I need a little more. Uh, let's have some salmon. Salmon tastes pretty good, in some way. Okay. Okay. Nope. Iron. 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 Well, you guys are really expensive. It's like. Either you don't take iron or you take a. Oh, what happened to the discount thing, dude? Guys, where's my discount? Is my discount gone? Alright, well, I guess I don't have discount anymore. Oh, I think that might be because I hit a villager last time, so they don't want to trade with me with a discount anymore. That's sad. Only three Embro? Okay, I kind of need a lot more. Like, um, he has a discount still. But he's not really open to trade at all, so... And I need a lot more redstone. Six is definitely not good enough. Maybe I should use a wood. Like I should make sticks and then trade sticks with some villagers. What do I have here? Ah, uh, not the redstone. Oh, we have some... Oh, we have a lot of rotten flesh, that's fine. And a lot of arrow, which is I don't know why. I mean, I just max out this entire chest of things right here, so not a great news. Uh huh, definitely not a good news. And I don't need a flower, so let's drop the poppy over here. Where are you? Give me more Ambro, thank you so much. Thank you. And now. Now, give me the redstone. Ah, where are you? Uh, where are you? Where are you? I need more redstone. Where did you go? There you are. Wait, no, not you. I need the other guy. There you are. All right. Wait a minute. Let me do a count. How many pistons do I need? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Is it eight? One, two, three, four. Ah, one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Four, eight, that's 32 plus two more, 34. I need 34 piston. Oh wow, I don't have enough redstone for that. And I, okay, I almost have enough iron for that, so that's not bad. Uh, yeah, I need more, uh, I need more iron and redstone, so guess it's time to trade with the villagers again. Okay, two more, two more, two more, two more. 34 piston, just like that. Oh wow, that's a lot of piston. Okay, so how this is going to work is basically... Okay, let's do this, do this. So basically, you guys know Sugar King will grow over time. So what I do is put a observer like over here. So it will observe when the sugar king grow up to like its maximum height, which is third, like the three block height. And I will have the piston. That's uh, where is the piston? Okay. So piston will be over here. So when the observer see there's a sugar king grow to its maximum level, it's gonna trigger all the piston on the second level, which is going to destroy the sugar king. Then sugar king will drop this water. It will get washed down over here. I could just stand here, collect sugar king. So, yep, it's just a lot easier, or not easier, but more efficient than just me walking around trying to get the Sugar King. Because it really just saved me the time that I don't have to walk around to destroy every single block. And hopefully there's some... No, not hopefully, but like I don't have to spend the time to destroy the Sugar King myself. It's going to do it for me. I just need to collect them over time. And even that, I could just like, you know, make some uh, hopper. I mean, not hopper. Yeah, hopper over here. I could just put the hopper over here and have the two chests over here. So it would just automatically collect the sugar cane for me every single time. Which is, you know, I could just, you know, hand out at my mob grinder over there or AFK fishing. And then it's just going to collect everything for me. That's pretty nice, isn't it? So... 
That's why. I'm building this auto sugar farm. Auto sugar cane farm. Because I need a lot of paper, like I said. Okay, I think this one will be like that and that. Okay, that's great. Let's do this one over here. That's a lot of piston. Okay. And this one over here. And last few piston. Perfect. Alright. Okay, now where's my observer? Oh wait, I have to make a observer and oh I still take fall damage. Alright. How do I make an observer again? <laughs> I don't remember anything. <laughs> I need two redstone and a okay, do I have that? No, maybe eh. Yes I do. So wait, was it how 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 do I make one? Okay, I'm just gonna do that. Just make my job easier. I make my life easier. And I need more uh cobblestone, so Alright, and let's fix this real quick. Eh, bet, bet, I fell. I don't need the I don't need the gravel. And the poppy. Okay. I fell every single time. Okay, so the observer is going to be at the third block, so let's do that. And like that and let's try okay wait i have to go all the way over here like that nah crap okay guys be nice yes all right so once this sugar king over here grow up to this high it's gonna trigger this observer and the observer is going to send out a redstone signal to trigger all the piston right here which is going to Destroy all the sugar cane and just to test it out. Let's see if it's going. Let's see if I put this observer at the right place. Yes, that's right. You see this stone, cobblestone trigger the piston. So when it destroy, it's gonna trigger it again and just take a close look over here. Piston goes out. And right, okay. I just need more um more redstone so I could complete this thing and that will be it let's see if those this is going to work oh wait somehow i didn't activate the redstone here oh it did okay it did it did it just i didn't see it or just didn't do it the first time for some reason why let's take a look again so uh did did it activate everything Yes, it did. Okay. Here's my auto sugar cane farm. It definitely works. It definitely works. Let me show you. So if the sugar cane grow over here. Boom. Well. Wait. Why didn't these one got destroyed? Okay. Wait. Okay. Okay. Let me get all the sugar cane. And let's do the test one more time. Like that and that. Oh, wait, those ones didn't get destroyed because I don't have the redstone over there. Okay, I was thinking like, wait, my uh, auto sugar farm didn't work, doesn't work. And it's like, oh, I don't have redstone over there. Okay, well, let's just do this using my hand and it's almost there. I mean, the grass haven't spread over here yet, so there is like two grass and one grass over there. So the grass just spread over here over time. And I need a lot more redstone, so redstone, if I trade with my, the 20, okay, 20 might be enough, let's see, fly back, maybe I should fly, maybe I should just use ender pro, okay, maybe I should just use ender pro, I mean, this is not a, like a long distance fly, I mean, I could fly to my sand farm over there, I should use like charging fly over there because that's actually a long fly and okay I have enough great that's actually a good oh wait a minute wait a minute wait a minute oh that okay get over here get over here oh do I need uh everything right here yeah I do need everything here okay 
Let's take down the stairs over here. Maybe I should make some hopper and just replace this block over here with hopper so it's going to collect all the things. Not too bad. Okay, so let's see. Ah, uh, what should I do? Um, let's do this. So, pickaxe, pickaxe. Okay, I didn't get everything back, but that's fine. Oh, you know what? I need to do something else. So, I have to ride this water down here like that. Place down cobblestone like that. Like that. Okay, now we could go back up. And hopefully this water is not going to mess up my portal down there. I'm not too sure. I just hope it's not going to mess it up. So if something dropped, like a sugar cane, it's going to collect by this hopper, enter this chest. Okay. And uh, let's go down, take a look my my thing over there. It didn't mess up, did it? Uh, almost. Almost, I almost messed it up, so let's fix it. Oh, shoot, I forgot to close my portal all this time. I feel there will be a creeper over there. I feel a creeper already went through the portal and went to the nether. So, I think I will have some surprise creeper attack. Let's see if it can fly out. Oh, okay, maybe I can't fly out. Maybe I should just do the normal thing. Can I fly out? Yes, I could! Okay, is it going to get me up there? Yes, it did. Cool, okay, you know what? This is a lot faster than just me riding the water up here, so very great. But I just need to practice how to use it, like try to fly, so that's not a bad thing. And uh, let's put this torch over here, I think. Okay, write this water down. I have to put cobblestone. Oh, I use a slab. Okay, I think I use slab and cobblestone like combined for this thing, so that's not too bad. Uh, okay. Another slab, just fill up that. Good. So, chest, chest, and hopper. Perfect. Just see if it works out. Yes, it does. All right. Ah. Well, here's a sugar cane. So I'm just gonna go here, place down the last two sugar cane, and yes, this is it. I got my auto sugar cane farm fully prepared and should work easy, no problem. I just feel like put some torch around it just so. Mob's not going to spawn. It's just for safety. Why not? You know, it does now it feels safe. And let's go get some arrow. I'm just gonna keep a lot of arrow on myself just cause why not. And let's put iron back since I don't need it anymore. Ender pro, I will leave some ender pro on me. Okay. Okay. Um. Let's cut down the trees over here. Grow more sapling. All right, guys. So this is a auto sugarcane farm. Uh, definitely works. Looks a little bit ugly, so maybe I should replace this thing using glass. And we will see how many sugar can I could get from this auto sugar farm. I mean, it's not a lot because the it's just gonna take time for the sugar cane to grow. But at least I don't have to like harvest it myself like this one over here. And in fact, I might destroy all the sugar canes over here just because it looks a little bit too ugly to have sugar canes around. And now it looks a lot cleaner. And do I have to get a sapling? No, I didn't. Okay. Ooh, whoa, oh, 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 I see a baby zombie. I see a flipping baby zombie. I see a flipping baby zombie. I see a flipping baby zombie. Iron golem, iron golem, kill that baby zombie. 
kill the baby zombie. Iron Golem. Iron Golem, kill this baby zombie. Kill it. Kill the baby zombie. Dude, kill the baby zombie. Bro, you're not gonna kill the baby zombie for me? Okay, I hate this Iron Golem. Maybe it's time to make an Iron Golem for myself to protect myself. Oh wait, I think I did. It's just an Iron Golem dead after I made it. Okay, well, there goes the baby zombie. What? Did I not put enough torch to keep that place lit? Okay, well, maybe one more over here. I mean, one more here? It looks good enough. I mean, I don't think I need more torch. Like, dude. Okay, and now it's like for sure it's good. Oh. It's not that bright in here. What well, about now? A lot better, isn't it? Okay, maybe I need some glowstone. Yeah, maybe I need some glowstone. I think the zombie or the baby zombie spawn over here. Let's take a look at the light level. The light level is 9. Wait, it's 15. What? 15 from the sky? Are you kidding me? Uh, what? Oh yeah, skylight is always 15. Okay, well, that's fine. Oh well. Okay, well, the only thing to prove my auto sugar cane farm is going to work is actually hang out at this chunk for a while so the sugar cane could really grow. And just to be accurate, I might turn, um, I'm just gonna turn all the sugar cane right here into paper so what do you guys see after it will be really oh one more okay let's just drop it there so i'm gonna you know afk fishing for a little bit and like an hour or something and let's see how many sugar cane we got i mean the sugar cane doesn't grow that fast so it's not gonna be a lot but it should be a good amount